So if you take away looks and you take away money, what does a man need to have to get your vagina? And how does he prove that he has those things? Because we're saying that there's piss in the dating pool, but we're the ones who created the piss by going around and having no standards and sleeping with every Tom, Dick, and Harry and having every Tom, Dick, and Harry's baby. I'm sorry, what? Like, and it's really not even every Tom, Dick, and Harry, right? It's There is a certain number of men that we're all dating. And again, I'll put my hand up, I'll be, you know, guilty of it like I can't imagine how many women my ex had ran through before me right because he's he's he is the, he's the men that you guys say you all want six foot nine former professional athlete I mean you guys don't generally ask for smart but I asked for intelligent he had two degrees smart as a whip and he was fit he was my, my ex was handsome he's a handsome man and that's why he had an ex-wife with two children and then a baby mama with two. That's why that man's got four babies. Because women want to have sex with him and therefore procreate with him. A lot of women were giving my ex vagina simply because of the way he looked. They didn't care about his, his intelligence. They didn't care about his resilience. They didn't even know anything about the two degrees. They didn't know about his life story. They didn't know about the things he overcame. They didn't care what books he read. They didn't care about his ambition. He was 6'9", and he was a professional basketball player, and he had a good peen. That's the standards by which apparently we now use to sleep with men and give them babies. Ladies, I am not mad at men for where we are right now in society because if you look at history, women have set the moral standards. We set the moral standards. When men were showing up to sit down with our fathers, it's because they knew that that's the only way they could get to us. They would sit down, they would have a conversation with fathers. They would bring roses. They would do whatever they would need to do to court you. And these women didn't just give away their vagina.